Final Cut Pro 10.6.7 just dropped a few days ago. Do not update. Wait for the next update or maybe two updates from now. This current version of Final Cut Pro is so broken. I personally experienced over 16 crashes over a 10 hour editing period. I have seen multiple friends who have crashes. I am seeing crashing all over Twitter. I'm receiving tons and tons of emails asking me what is wrong with Final Cut Pro. So for update 10.6.7, do not update. Also, it's extremely important that you turn off automatic updates. It is important that you are completely aware of when you are installing an update for Final Cut Pro because you might be mid-project and you don't want to potentially break anything in the future. If you don't know how to turn off automatic updates, just go up to your Apple, go to System Settings, locate your General Settings, then jump into Software Update, and in here, click on the I next to Automatic Update. Go to install application updates from the App Store, go ahead and disable that, and that should resolve that issue. Also, before you ever update Final Cut Pro, I strongly recommend that you either have a Time Machine backup, or if you do not have Time Machine, you jump into Finder, you go to Applications, Final Cut Pro, right click on it, and then select Compress Final Cut Pro. This will create a duplicate of Final Cut Pro that you can later jump back to. You'll see that I have version 10.6.4. That was the most stable release I personally experienced as of late. However, if you unfortunately updated and you don't have any sort of backup, I personally am not aware of a way you can get an older version of Final Cut Pro. If anybody is aware, please share it down in the comments so that people can get their old versions of Final Cut Pro back. Apple, please add the ability for us to get older versions of Final Cut through the App Store. This is a professional software and oftentimes we need to go to older versions for various features and fixes. One other thing I wanna quickly mention, if you wanna track the progress of Final Cut Pro, see how well it is performing, I strongly recommend that you check out fcp.cafe. Over here they have a bug tracker. People can submit their different bugs that they're facing in Final Cut Pro. Um, you can get troubleshooting help and stuff like that. You can also see the latest news with Final Cut Pro. So it's a really great website. I know this is far from my usual video on YouTube, but I think that this is an important message to get out. With that being said, thank you so much for watching. Consider sharing this video around the Final Cut Pro community so others don't make this mistake. And I cannot wait to see you on Friday when we get back to my regularly scheduled programming.